People often overwork watercolor. I find that we go from our techniques to painting and then suddenly students are overwhelmed and they begin to work and work and work at a painting to the point where it's muddy and they become frustrated. For this exercise, I'd like you to choose a simple object and see how quickly you can render it with as few brush strokes as possible. You might take an object like a banana or an apple and go over it once and then stop. See if you can do it in, I don't know, three or four brush strokes. I've just penciled out a leaf and I'm going to see if I can just get the gestalt of the leaf or the, the sense of a fall leaf without um, overworking it, without fussing with a lot of veins, just giving, uh, giving us the idea of a, what a leaf is. So let me, <laughs> whoops, we've got a little spot on the paper, but we'll just ignore that for now. So I'm going to first do one side back and forth. I'm going to mess around with color and not worry about it being true to the leaf. You notice that I'm not going back over a thing, keeping the color fairly dark, playing around with fall color. And I think I'll even get some dark Payne's gray in there. And because some of the imperfections are the very thing that makes something like this look the way it is, I'm going to go back and just dot in a couple of imperfections as if the leaf has a little bit of a hint of disease or tar spot or something. And then just trail down the stem and call it finished. So you might do this as an exercise and just simply seeing how quickly you can render something without going over and over again and then leave it.